Today, potential school closures and mergers are the center of an expected vote with Oakland Unified School Board. As KPX 5's Jocelyn Moran reports, many continue the fight to try to keep their schools open. Jocelyn. Yeah, Lynn, Amanda, that's right. We've seen a number of efforts in the last week. We've heard from parents, seen protests, and two staffers are going on their eighth day of hunger striking. They don't want to see their schools close. This video here from yesterday in front of Westlake Middle School, students painted signs supporting teachers who were striking. Now, ahead of this potential vote tonight, it, the topic to whether to close or merge about a dozen schools. Oakland Unified cites a budget deficit and declining enrollment. The district says for the amount of students in the district, there are far too many campuses, but parents and teachers say the implications of this go beyond the surface. Oakland Unified parent Vanessa Gutierrez says if Brookfield closes, she's worried about losing the special ed teacher her son relies on. For him to get sent to another school with different teachers, that's that's honestly something I will always try to fight for my kids because I don't like them being changed from one teacher to another. There's not really a school that's within safe walking distance from here. If you've ever been to the Brookfield to Bernie Park area, it's not really a place where people just kind of walk around freely for miles. Now, in a statement, Oakland Unified says in part, quote, we know that our students, staff, and families all agree that we need a district of thriving schools, yet not everyone necessarily agrees on how best to get there. Now, another walkout is planned for today. Oakland Unified special board meeting tonight is set to start at 5 p.m. Of course, we'll keep you updated. I'll send it back to you guys. All right.